Several of you have asked what UI I'm using. I'm using the Guild Wars 2 UI in World of Warcraft. It's simply a UI mod that kind of just replaces a lot of the basic functionality with an interface that honestly looks almost exactly like Guild Wars 2. A couple of the key features I'll point out are along the edge of my screen is this like tear torn paper look. Um, and it looks kind of cool. It's a little bit grunge look. The EXP bar is down here at the bottom of my screen, just like Guild Wars 2, which is neat. The health globe for me is in the bottom center. Between It basically breaks up the bottom main hotbar. They put my focus as a hunter just above the right-hand side of that. The additional hotbars for the left and the right have been placed kind of where they are in Guild Wars 2 as well. And in the upper left-hand corner are the normal icons you would find for WoW, but they've been turned into the same icons that are in Guild Wars 2 which I think is a pretty nice touch. It gets them out of the way, they're kind of faded in the background, they look pretty nice. The minimap in the bottom right is very much the same. You can hover over it to get the time. And any of your normal things that go around your minimap can still be placed and moved, like so. And the calendar right here functions the exact same way as it always does, but it looks like Guild Wars 2 calendar. And the garrison info is there. I've moved my pet window uh, from where it normally is down to this little space between my hotbars and my minimap. It seems to function very well for me, and then when I'm using a DPS counter, I can simply turn it on and turn it off down there. The chat window uh, has taken on Guild Wars 2 functionality. The friends icon is the same. You can actually use a Guild Wars 2 font, but I've disabled it because I find that on my monitor, at least for my eyes, it looks a little less crisp. But if you enable the Guild Wars 2 font, all the fonts look like Guild Wars 2, which was a cool touch. So the inventory right here is again is Guild Wars 2. I thought it was very nice. The gear right here will automatically sort your bags for you if you'd like that. And again you can click on a bag, turn it on or off. Close it with the X. If you target uh, your target looks like the Guild Wars 2 target. I've chosen to put mine in the bottom middle of the screen with the target of target slightly above that. When I turn on weak auras, which is another UI mod I use to help with like rotation and cooldowns, um, they just fit nicely above it. So this is how I've chosen to place my target. But you can make it like Guild Wars 2 where it's higher up on your screen towards the center. It's up to you. I, I like to move it down towards the bottom. The Guild Tracker in the top, top right, is the Guild Wars 2 Guild Tracker. And all of these features are controlled by the Guild Wars 2 UI settings. So again, you hit Escape or open up your game menu. And the bottom, there's a Guild Wars 2 UI settings. And it brings up a window that looks just like Guild Wars 2. And there's a section to manage modules, uh, target unit frames, uh, focus frame setting, and HUD settings. So in the modules, you can turn on power or turn off power. It basically um, is like a mana power bar replacement. I choose to use it. Um, there's the target frame replacement. Basically, the modules, you can enable them to replace the WoW version with the Guild Wars 2 version. So if you want Guild Wars 2 tooltips, you enable that. I chose to disable them. I actually like the, the WoW tooltips better. You can enable the action bars, which will be the Guild Wars 2 action bars, which are what I have. I think I like them better as well. There's where you enable the font. The health globe in the bottom middle, I like that. Uh, it also changes colors um, for various states that you're in, like poisoned or cursed, just like, just like your health bar would. Focus, I choose to use that. Uh, chat bubbles. I think are bugged, so I've turned those off. Quest Tracker, Chat, Guild Wars 2 Chat, uh, Player Auras, I have on, Bag is on, Casting Bar is on. Uh, to kind of give you an idea what the Casting Bar looks like, it'll be in the bottom middle section right here. Again, very clean, very simple. Um, target, it's all the stuff like health percentage, show buffs, health value, etc. Focus, um, it's basically like focus target, health value, debuffs. And then the HUD is things like um, fading action bars, uh, fade chat when inactive, and the dynamic HUD, which changes the HUD, ex um, the HUD appearance. And then anytime you change any of that, just um, click save and reload. And also, this is where you edit where everything is. You just click in the bottom left here, move HUD. There's a couple other really neat features I'll show you. For example, when you go into water, remember in Guild Wars 2, well, as soon as I drop into the water, notice how the bottom changed? It changed to this, like, water-looking um, UI. I'll show you that if you missed it. As soon as I'm out, it's that grungy dirt look. Then I go in, bubbly waters. 
I thought that was a very, very nice touch. And I don't know if you missed it as well, the top middle of the screen there is my breath bar. Kind of Guild Wars 2-ish, sort of. So yeah, that's the Guild Wars 2 UI mod for World of Warcraft. It's the one that I use. I like it because it's really clean. Um, I notice no degradation in game performance. And overall, it's just a very nice, uh, basically, total UI replacement. So I'm going to go ahead and put the link to the mod uh, below the video. So if you're interested, check it out. It's really cool.